Merry Christmas, everyone. Hi, my name is Lori, and this is Lori's Journey. I do videos about my faith, my life struggles, and all sorts of experiences to share with you. Today, I just wanted to wish you all a very Merry Christmas. I hope you're enjoying some time with some family today. And I hope that if it's a difficult situation there, that you can just get away, go to another room, and take some time to yourself and get away from those altercations you might be having. So today I just wanted to read you the Christmas story. This is from Luke chapter 2, and I'm using the NASB version. Now in those days a decree went out from Caesar Augustus that a census be taken of all that inhabited the earth. This was the first census taken while Quirinius was governor of Syria, and everyone was on his way to register for the census, each to his own city. Joseph went up from Galilee, from the city of Nazareth to Judea, to the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was of the house and family of David, in order to register along with Mary, who was engaged to him and was still with child. While they were there, the days were completed for her to give birth, and she gave birth to her firstborn son, and she wrapped him in cloths and laid him in a manger, because there was no room for them in the inn. In the same region, they there were some shepherds staying out in the fields and keeping watch over their flock by night. And an angel of the Lord suddenly stood before them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were terribly frightened. But the angel said to them, Do not be afraid, for behold, I bring you good news of great joy, which will be for all the people. For today in the city of David, there has been born to, for you a Savior, who is Christ the Lord. This will be a sign for you, you will find a baby wrapped in cloths and lying in a manger. And suddenly there appeared with the angel a multitude of the heavenly host, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace among men with whom he is pleased. So I just wanted to read that to you today to remember the real story of Christmas. It's not about the gifts. It's about being together with family and celebrating the day that Christ our Savior was born. And He rose again to save us. So Merry Christmas and I'll see you next week.